hot. I look a mess. I look a mess. Look at yourself. <laughs> Hockey game's more important than skiing with their best friends. Yeah, it sure looks that way. It means we'll be alone for the whole weekend. Nick, we've got to stop. What's the problem? Nothing. I've got to go. Oh, you're joking. Come on. No, I'm bursting. You're hopeless. Why didn't you go back to the gas station? I didn't need to go then. There's a good spot. Who's got to see you out here? <laughs> no peeking, OK? Come on, Tess. We haven't got all day. Tess, run those little kilos off. <laughs> Come on, Tessa, run. It's good training for you. Come on, Nick. It's my turn. Let me drive. Oh. Tess, are you okay? I'm sorry, Tess. Look, I didn't mean to. We haven't even started the trip.
wait up, you guys. Oh, Nick's looking pretty pissed off. I better go. Relax. <laughs> Isn't that the whole idea? Yeah, but there's no point in carrying a joke past the punchline. Wait! It's working so well. Don't spoil it. The joke's a joke, you know? You made your point!
don't boil on me now. Can you give me a hand here, mate? Just hang in there, buddy. I'll be back in an hour. Okay, you win. breaking down the door. Sorry, I wonder if you could help me. Sure can. It's okay, I don't need gas. I wanted to find out if anyone had passed through here. No gas. Okay, okay, I have some gas. A red laser with a with a with a girl, blonde. She's pretty, you know, wavy hair. A red laser. Blonde driving a red laser. We're all looking for a blonde driving a red laser. No. Someone else is driving the red laser, but she got into it. No. I ain't seen nothing. Are you sure? Yeah. You could have missed it going past. Could have. No. The way you're saying it, I would have remembered. That's 350. Yeah. Keep the change. Hell no, she's in it. Come on, what do you take me for? We're all enjoying this, having some fun. You were driving too fast. Didn't mean to frighten you. Nick will be worried sick by now. Come on. I'll take you back to your boyfriend. Excuse me. Your coffee? 
Yeah, thanks. Could have a donut too, thanks. Are you sure you never saw that red laser come through? Look, I don't have time to look at the roads. You can use your phone then. It's out of order. I really need to use one. Well, you can use the one behind the bar, but you'll have to pay for it. It's okay, look, just put down the tab, all right? Yeah, hi, hi, Jeanette, it's Nick, yeah. I'm in Dawson's Creek. Yeah, um, she hasn't... Yeah, we got separated for a while. She hasn't phoned you in the last half hour or so. N no, it's OK, look. No, I see it coming, yeah. Yeah, OK, well, take it easy. Bye. Where's Tessa? Where's Tess? Come, where's Tessa? We had you going for a while back there, eh, Nick? Come, where the fuck's Tessa? He's up, pal. I dropped her off back at the gas station. Don't look at me. It was her idea. Took some persuasion to get rid of the chick. Anyway, I told her, Nicky boy. Oh, Nicky boy, be worried. Sick. Yeah, sick, I said. Sick! <laughs> You want to watch where you're driving, mate? Have you seen her? Tessa! He said he's going to drop her off here. Did this guy in the red laser drop her off? No one dropped nobody off here. It's got to be here. Is there another gas station then? No. Are you sure? Am I sure? Of course I'm sure. What do you think this is? A bloody quiz show or something? You want to be taking a break, mate? No good getting heated up like this. Damn it, that arsehole said he dropped her off here. Be happening. I'll kill the bastard. You walk in. You want a holiday then? It's a good time of year. Beautiful out here, I tell you. I don't usually come out this time of year. Too cold, I reckon. Excuse me, look, sorry for disturbing you. I wonder whether you could help me. Um, you, you see, I was playing this game and all went wrong. Did you see a girl on the road back there? Um, she was picked up by a guy and he said he'd drop her off here. She's about 18, about 5 foot 4. She's got blonde, wavy hair. Be your wife, mister. Don't ask personal questions, Leanne. No, we haven't seen any, anything, have we, darling? Please, you've got to try and remember. You see, she, must, she was supposed to be waiting for me. You must have passed her on the road back there. <laughs> That's 20 bucks, mate. 
Look, please, I'm sure she's in trouble. If you could just... John, it's getting late. Let's go. Please, if you do see it, tell I'm here in Dawson's Creek. All right? Will you do that for me? Tell Tessa that Nick's waiting for in Dawson's Creek. Will you do that for me? Thanks for freaking helping! That's no way to talk to my customers. You're lucky I don't call the cops. The cops? Yeah, call the cops. It's Sunday. Where can I find them? Deputy Martin, up there on the right, about four miles. Misty Vale. Tell you what, though, he won't be too happy about being disturbed on Sunday. OK, let's go over this one more time. All right, we're, we're going to Mount Jasper for a skiing trip holiday, and um, we are playing this game, and it all went wrong. Um, I drove off on a... You just left on the side of the road, and you drove away? No, no, I was only about 20 metres up the road. It was just a joke, you know? Joke. Yeah. I haven't got time for jokes today, Mr. Callum. You better come into the office. Red laser. Maybe she fancied the guy in the red laser. She wouldn't do that, you know. It's not her style. Now listen, Mr. Callum. You drag me away from a pleasant Sunday lunch with my family to tell me some story about a about a about your girlfriend and a game. It's no fucking game, all right? Now, you watch your language, Sonny. I'm trying to help you. Now, what did she say again when she first drove past? She said, see you in Jasper. See you in Jasper? Yeah, see you in Jasper. And then you eventually caught up with the red laser. But don't you understand? She wasn't with this guy anymore. Well, maybe she got tired of you and your games and hitched her lift home. She wouldn't do that. Well, perhaps she, uh, perhaps she hitched a lift to Jasper on her own. I mean, that's the sort of thing she does, isn't it? Perhaps this is one of her little games. Martin. Oh, hello, Laura. The young guy ran off from the pub without paying. It sounds silly, but I just thought you should know. Well, when did this happen? About an hour ago. Mm-hmm. What did he look like? Cute, dark hair, leather jacket, great smile. Well, listen, Laura, don't you worry about it. I'll look into it right away. No, no, no problem. Oh, Laura, I'll be in for a coffee later. OK, bye. Isn't there someone at Mount Jasper we could find? $4.32 to the pub. That was the waitress. Shit. I'm sorry. I, I don't normally do that. I'm really sorry. Listen, Mr Callan, can I suggest you get moving? Dawson Creek is a quiet little town. We'd know if your girlfriend was here. So why don't you go look for us someplace else? Well, go on, shove off. G'day. Get her up. Where's the blonde? What's that? <laughs> the blonde? Where's the blonde? There's a bloke in here earlier looking for a blonde and a red laser. What did he look like? Oh, a city bloke. Yellow Corolla, 78, bit beaten up. The way he was going, I thought he was going to blow a gasket. He's really wound up about this blonde. What kind of blonde? Oh, she's beautiful. Beautiful woman, apparently. I never saw her. Long, wavy hair, legs. You haven't seen a red laser, have you? <laughs> you got a red laser. <laughs> you could be the one. <laughs> Help yourself in there. Not much an offer at the present moment. How's that going, Jimmy? Hey, Dave -o! This guy, which way did he go? Who? The yellow Corolla. Are you sure you saw a guy come through here? Yeah, he's he gone. I, 
get, get your change. Can I speak to um, Deputy Martin, please? What, are you still having lunch? Well, tell him Jimmy wants to talk to him. And it's, it's a real emergency. Who are you talking to? No one. I'm just getting your change. You shouldn't have done that. I, I didn't do nothing. It's anything, not nothing. Didn't do anything? Right! I, I didn't do anything. Well, that's good. What's your name? Jimmy Biggs. What, what do you want? Closer, Jimmy Biggs. I'll tell you. It's a secret. <laughs> That was great back there. We really had Nicky going. Wish you could have seen his face. Hey, work like a dream. Look, mate, I'm sorry. Are you sure? I've been stuck in the store all day. Don't sit away. Sure thing. Cheers. If you do see it, it's really important. Just tell her to stay here. I'll, I'll be back. <laughs> we were going great back then. Isn't this exciting, eh? Right? You're having fun?
Hello? What are you still doing in Dawson Creek, Callan? Have you seen Jimmy? Who's Jimmy? Hey, Jimmy! Jimmy! Turn it off. Turn the bloody thing off! Okay, okay. Just don't point that gun at my head. Now, get out. Get your hands up! I first gotta open the goddamn door. Don't talk back to me, Sonny. Put your hands on your head. On your head! What's this all about? Come on, let's just get serious. Oh, I'm very serious, son. Now, get out of the car. Nice and easy. I know this is nice, quiet little town, David. Don't you think you're overreacting here? Shut the fuck up, son. This has got to be a mistake. I said shut up. Spread them. Now, no more of your bloody bullshit. Where's Jimmy? You mean the weirdo that works here? Where is he? How should I know? Checking the men's guy's got a shit sometimes. Oh! I'm losing my patience with you, Callan. First you come into town and, and, and tell me some cock and bull story about your girlfriend. Duck out of the coffee shop and then come round here to bust the till. That's bullshit, all right? I'm looking for Tessa. I'm not trying to bust some stupid till. Get your hands on your head. Hind your head. Blood on the floor in there, son. Hey, Jimmy! Jimmy! Hey, take these cuffs off! Hey, Jimmy! worried by now. You'll have half the police force looking for me! You think that's possible? Nick! Wake up, Tess. Nick thinks you're safely on a bus back home by now. Please just let me go, I promise I won't say anything. I've had just about enough of your whipping. Why don't you just shut up? Enjoy yourself. Balance on the edge. <laughs> yeah, use some of that imagination. Open your mind. Fella. 
Where's Jimmy? Hmm? Come on, let's go find Jimmy. Oh, come on. Deputy, please. He's, he's been here. The guy in the red lace. You've got to help me. Can you take the fucking cuffs off, you pig? Oh, Irene. Will Martin. Yeah, is Jimmy there? Oh, he's not with Davo, is he? You could get away from me, Tessa. Well, I'm just going to have to teach you a lesson. It's just you and me, Tessa. You really thought I was going to. Corolla, ITO 305. I guess it's heading towards Wild Dog Creek. Over. Granger thinks she's got a prowler down in the horse paddock. Would you check it out? Uh -huh. 
I'm sorry about today. I, I didn't mean. Don't worry about it. I got the money. Just don't do it again. I, I wanted to ask you. Have you seen that red laser again? You see, I'm looking for a girl. She, she's about your age. She's similar height. You know, she's pretty. <laughs> I like that. That's neat. Well, why don't we just cut the bullshit? Well, why don't you come back to my place? And oh, look, uh, count me out, all right? Um, you know, look, um, sorry. Did Deputy Martin give you that tip? I, I left you a tip. What's your problem? You are weird. You know that? You are really weird. Eight. Look, why don't we go and get some real food? We can bring it back here and have a really nice dinner, just, just you and I. <laughs> That's not how it really is, Tess. That's not how it is. Really. Is it? Is it? Oh, fuck you! Well, that's no way to speak to a friend. I'm sorry. You're driving me crazy. I, I want you to understand. I, I want you to... want you. making it worse. I know you're there. It's only a matter of time. 
Now come out. And I might not get so mad. You haven't seen me mad yet. Nick, I just want to go home now. I think we should wait here. You can catch us on the road. Just for a few hours and then we'll go home. What are you barking at? You stay here, Stan. We'll go down there. Look. Stanley, you stay here. I'm here, what is it? You're okay? I'm fine. I think we should go back to Dawson's Creek and explain the whole thing. It won't take long. Then we'll go home, okay? Okay. Okay. Thank 
Frankie, you there? Roger. What's up, Will? We found ourselves a homicide. Jimmy Biggs, stabbed in the chest. Careful down there, guys. Hey, look, Jimmy Biggs. I wonder who could have done it. I suppose we should put him in the bag first, eh? Sorry to hear about that, Will. Yeah, look, could you set up some roadblocks your end? Try and cut him off if he tries to get through to Fort Murray. I'm sending Lacey up the pass. What are we looking for, over? <sighs> Suspect is a Nick Callan, age 22. Driving an old yellow Corolla. He escaped custody last night. OK, I'll walk the road off to Bodine. You just keep it up there, Will. Lacey! Sir. Listen, Will, we want to help out. Well, we don't want to sit back with this guy, we owe it. Look, look, this yeah. is not a footy match. We've got a homicide here. Now, Lacey, I want you to set up a roadblock at White Horse Pass. Sir, Callan's probably 300 miles away by now. Look, it's procedure, boy, procedure. Now, get to it. That's permission to take JD with me. Come on, Lacey. Will, we can get him, Will. Yeah, we can. yeah, yeah. down there for Pete's sake. Show some respect. Got it? Yeah. Sorry, Dip, but it's bloody slippery down there. Stop. Stop. Again. You know, Jack, this is what the training's been all about. I mean, this is what I do best. Yeah, you've got the edge, Lacey. Okay, this is it. Come in, 3 zero. Yep, go ahead, Lacey. Suspect's on the road and moving up. We're ready to engage. Okay, over and out. Tess, I really don't like it. Don't worry about it, we can explain everything. Just stay where you are. Shut up and stay where you are. What about the girl? Come on, Lacey, don't play soft obesity crims. Okay, get your hands up. Are you Nick Kellen? Yes. Nick, what's going on? Look, it's okay, they're just being careful. Okay, moving nice and easy. <laughs> Listen, please, this is a terrible mistake. <laughs> I'd say it's one hell of a mistake. But you should have thought about that sooner. Look, can't we just all work this out? Listen, man, shut the frig up! Look, get your freaking hands in the air! Look, what are we doing? You've got the wrong man! It's no use, right? We'll get our chance later. Look, we're wasting time. Okay, pal. Kiss the floor. Look, can't we go back to the station and, and speak to Deputy Martin? Get the fucking floor before I blow your balls off! Why has everyone in this town got balls up their asses? No explaining's gonna bring our Jimmy back. Nick! Nick! Get off him! Shut up! Get off him, you bastard! Shut, Shut up! up. <laughs> Damn, Mungo! Oh. Calling cut 3-0. 
Look, this poor deputy Martin, all right? Lacey, I'm reading you. Come in. Vicky, I'm crazy. Get off him! Sue, we got Callan. Situation's under control. All right, he's got a girl with him as well. Nice work. Just be careful and don't take any chances. He's a real slippery number. Get off him! See you back at the station. Uh -huh. Over. Jack. You've got the wrong man! Oh, shut up! That's him! There he is, officer! You've got to do something! That's him! That's him! Come on, Lacey! That's him! That's him! That's him! That's him. That's him. He tried to rape me! It's okay! It's okay! Just it's shut up! Someone broken down, officer. Do you need a hand? No, no thanks. It's all under control. He's crazy. You know what Just he's relax. Like. I'm he's here. Get him. Lacey! Yeah, coming, Jack. Could I have a look at your license, please, sir? Just routine. Sure. Lacey! Yes, Jack. Uh, must be in the car. Right? Beautiful day for a drive in the country, eh, officer? You don't know any place around here I could get a good English breakfast, do you? Yeah, actually. John Bennett's down the road. Oh. Lacey! Lacey! <laughs> <laughs> Lacey! For God's sake, pull yourself together, man! Yeah, it's a bit late for that. Man! Tessa! What's going on out there? Tessa, what's happening? <laughs> <laughs> Tessa, I missed you, baby. Where did you go? Back to old Nicky boy. Where's Nicky now? You need him, eh? Tess up. So, did you tell Nick what we got up to, Tess? Did you tell him what fun we had together? <laughs> Lacey, come in, over. Lacey, come in, over. Lacey, please come in. Do you read? Over. <laughs> Hello, Tess. Got you. <laughs> hey, Jess, you filthy hands off her! Aren't you glad to see me, Tess? Let it go! What am I gonna do with you? Tess, <laughs> I thought I taught you something about life, and now you want to run away from it all. Oh, that's bad, Tess. It's very bad. <laughs> Why can't you just leave us alone? 
<laughs> You're alone, baby. We're all alone. Didn't you know that? Hey, you freak! Let it go! When I first saw you, oh, it was magic. I said to myself, this is the girl for me. You were alive, exciting, ready to play with life, just like me. But now... Now you've just turned into a big disappointment. Just like all the others. <laughs> Lacey, do you copy? Over. I'm coming up my horse pass. Over and out.
Montes. <laughs> you couldn't hurt me. Both you and I know that. I... It was all for you, Tessa. I did it all. I did everything. For you! Everything! Take a look. Hey, you wait here. Now don't move. I'll be back in a few minutes. you oh. oh am i glad to see you officer i said who are you me jeremy b fisher oh it hurts there's a madman out here you've got to find him officer where's callum callum <laughs> who's callum nick callum he said he was looking for his girlfriend <laughs> his girlfriend you mean Tessa? Have you seen her? Is she okay? Where is she? Yeah, she's back there. She's okay. What the fuck's going on here? Oh, it's crazy, officer. This Nick guy. Never seen him before in my life. He just starts following Tessa and me. Can't get rid of him. Let me give you a hand. Come on. <laughs> what happened to your leg? Oh, the bastard shot me, but I managed to get away. That's when I lost Tessa. Thanks. <laughs> Jeremy B. <laughs> Travis <laughs> B. Bickoff. <laughs> <laughs> Norman C. Bates. <laughs> Humphrey B. Bear. <laughs> William S. Burroughs. Alfred E. Newman. Deputy D. Dog. Which one do you like?
road's got to be up here. Come on. We've gone too far. Are you sure? Just wait here, right? I'll, I'll see if I can see the road. Nikki, glad you could make it. Enough, all right, enough. Yeah, believe me, I've had enough. Yeah, it's all over. Ended. Benito. Just relax, all right? Just let me remind you who started this shit. Not me. I just played along with you. And where did that get me, hey? One mistake. One stupid bloody mistake. I fell for an impassive bitch. And boy, did you make me pay for that. Well, Tessa, I hope you're pleased with yourself. I hope you're satisfied now that your little game's over because it's time to say goodbye. No, please don't shoot us. Don't shoot us. Say bye-bye. <laughs> Would you like? Are oh, you fucking crazy? Now that you're freaked in the head, you're gone. This should make you really happy. Watch this, and remember what you've done to me. <laughs> no, I didn't. Ah. Forget it. Come on, he's shit. Come on, forget it. Ah. Come on! Don't look back! Don't look back! Why did he do that? Forget him, right? Forget him! Come on!
you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be held against you in a court of law. If you cannot afford a lawyer, Ah, <laughs> 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 <laughs>